hi everyone thank you for coming back to my channel today's video i want to talk about pen foster um, as a lot of my videos is based off of pen foster program for a vet technician um, and i want to talk about the program um, i wish that there were more videos like this uh, when i started the pen foster uh, vet tech program um, so here I am trying to make my own since there's not a lot out there um, from when I last researched so when I spoke to people about me doing an online vet tech course um, and online college a lot of people just I got the impression that a lot of people thought that was like an easy A. Um, I wouldn't be learning as much as I could learn in college um, and that was a and like a lot of people said there would be less work and I want to tell you that most of that is not the truth um, it is easier in the aspect of if you are working full-time and if you are a single mom or if you have kids um, it is way easier in the fact that you don't have to travel and go to a college in itself you know you can do it in your pajamas you can do it anytime um, the coursework you know like you don't have it's not due on an exact date um, so I know working full-time and being a single mom it just makes that part easier to finish college um, and then as far as like the work in itself um, because I went to a college physically um, I can compare and contrast both now when I went to a vet tech program on campus um, there was a lot less work that we had to do opposed to online work there is more essays that you have to do on the online college vet tech course than there would be when you're going when you're going to on campus i think that's just because the teachers can like physically see you and they're teaching and they know where you are um, but with the online college i think that they just give you much more work to just make sure that you are on track and see where you're at. The great thing about Penn Foster, I do want to say too, is the money. The money that you spend in this college, you get so much more. When I was on campus, it like the tuition itself was so much more the books like you had to pay extra for the books with Penn Foster they include everything they include the books they include the course they do monthly payment plans with regular college they don't do any of that so if you have any money concerns I highly recommend Penn Foster and also when I talk to other um, co-workers that I work with who went to on-campus college for their vet tech degree they are still in a lot of debt where me I just paid my way through college I paid my monthly payments on time on on Penn Foster and therefore I don't have any college debt which is amazing which there's so many people people that like wish they had that um, so if you have any money concerns Penn Foster is the way to go the only people that I don't recommend to do this course are people who are not in the field yet now if you do want to get in the field and you're trying to get your foot in the door um, having this on your resume saying that you are in a vet tech program will help you but if you're not in the field itself I don't recommend it because you're gonna get lost in the books the hardest part of the program I want to say for me was finding a externship because um, once you're done with all the um, test and the exams and the essays you then have to do an externship um, in your second semester and your fourth semester and for me that was the hardest part because you have to find a animal hospital that is willing to work with you as far as having someone take a video for you while you're doing the tasks as well as an hospital that has all the equipment for you to do those tasks um, the hardest part or I should say why it was so hard when I was doing the externship was because there was a lot of animals that you don't see 
um, all the time in a small animal hospital um, and the emergency videos um, that you had to do you don't get to do that often um, and during the externship you do have a time frame when you have to finish all those videos um, so that was the hardest part for me um, because um, you do have to do things on like mice you have to do things on guinea pigs you have to do things on um, sheep and um, cows horses um, and you especially I don't know like where you live but in where I live I live more in a city um, area so it is much harder to find a place to do those videos now I do want to say Penn Foster was amazing and like trying to help me find a place to do the externship and they did give me a lot of resources um, you know people to reach out um, and a lot of places where students have done their externship um, so they do know how to train or you know take videos or what kind of videos they're looking for um, so those are the animal hospitals that you do want to go to are the ones that have had students already um, go there for those externships um, and there are quite a few options um, to go to and um, as far as Penn Foster helping me in that you know and I even like called them you know almost crying saying like I live in the city um, there's no animal hospitals anywhere near me that have horses and cows um, I don't think I'm gonna finish you know this program they gave me the courage and they you know they lifted me up and gave me positive um, positive feedback saying that I'm gonna do this you're you'll be fine and they gave me this number and this um, place that I could go to um, to call and finish that externship part and so I do want to say they are great um, with helping they also are great what keep emailing you and keep calling you with positive you know you're doing great you're almost there um, you know they are very good with calling you and making sure that you're staying on task and letting you know that you can finish this so my overall experience with Penn Foster was that it is hard. It is very hard. In my opinion, it's harder to do it online because of the self-motivation, um, you know, the fact that you have to do it on your own. Um, the essays, there's just so much essays, so much more you have to do. Um, you know, the externship, you have to find it on your own. Um, it is a lot harder um, to finish. Well, it is a lot harder to do this schoolwork however the tuition is cheaper um and as far as if you're working um full-time you know working full-time you have kids you don't you know you have a time restraint it is so much better to do i highly 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 recommend to all the moms out there um to all the vet techs vet assistants um, that are already in the field trying to actually get the, their education I highly highly recommend it because it's it's almost impossible to go to college and work full-time or be a mom and go to college so it's I highly recommend it um, the tuition is great the staff um, that work for Penn Foster is great um, I had no issues with you know money um, you know if there was any issues with the internet not working or their you know their they answer any time of day they're great with communication um, so I do recommend it um, to anybody who is already in the field or trying to get their foot in the door um, and do and they do plan on working while they're in this program I highly recommend it um, and I want to say that I graduated um, you know a couple months ago from vet tech um, program in Penn Foster um, so I can say I am a single mom working full-time 40 plus hours in the vet tech field um, and single mom and I made it so um, it did take me a lot longer than it should have but um, you know I did it slowly but I I'm here now and I have a certificate and I'm very proud to say that I have graduated from Penn Foster and you can do it too. 
thank you so much for watching the entire video if you like my content please put a like to it um, and subscribe to me I have a lot of videos on my page um, from the Penn Foster program externship so if you're in Penn Foster um, hopefully my videos will help you or if you're willing um, to sign up for the Penn Foster program vet tech um, hopefully it will help you along your way and hope you guys have a nice day